Hello all and welcome back to our small block Chevy 350 rebuild. In this episode, we are going to replace the springs, valve seals, retainers, and locks with new springs from the recommended uh, kit that was um, labeled on our cam card of the Lenati cam that we are running in our build. Uh, small story short, small story short, long story short, we uh, picked up these heads from a local swap meet, uh, their world product, Sportsman 2. They came with a 1.550 diameter spring, and the uh, recommended kit that I picked up comes with 1.266 diameter, which is fine. Um, being the first time that I am rebuilding an engine from the block up, in my head I thought that the bigger springs would be the way to go. Bigger springs, the better. Uh, but unfortunately, the more people I talked to, they said that it's best to go with the recommended. As if I have too much pressure on the springs, it could collapse the valves or even bend uh, the valve stems. Uh, so that's what I did. Picked up the kit. And we're going to uh, replace all this, all that stuff during this uh, video, and also do some relapping of the valves, as they uh, did not look in too bad a shape. We just uh, used a wire wheel to knock off some of the uh, carbon composites that uh, were on some of them, yeah, cleaned them up, greased them, slid them back in there, and all is good to go. Uh, I want to thank all you guys for following uh, my YouTube channel and uh, for all you small block Chevy uh, enthusiasts. Um, stay tuned for the next part where we'll be putting the heads on the uh, block itself and uh, continue the build.